Hi, I'm Mindy Peters, the Solutions Manager at SPI, and in this video, I am going to show you how to purchase a website theme on the ThemeForest Marketplace and how to upload that into WordPress. So it's the beginning of a new year and you may be thinking like, this is the year I'm going to do it. This is the year I'm going to launch my business. I'm going to build my brand. I'm going to set up a website. And we have a great five day free challenge for you. If you go to buildyourownbrand.co, Pat Flynn will walk you through five days of assignments of exercises on how to purchase your domain name, how to set up your website hosting, how to install a theme, and then how to install all of the things you need on the back end. So security plugins, SEO plugins, Google Analytics, those sorts of things. And then how to customize what you need on the front end of your website, the key pages your website should have. Now on day two of that challenge in the first lesson, Pat shows you how to set up a theme for the website that you have set up on the uh, domain host Flywheel. And Flywheel has several free themes that come included with the website that are really great. And Pat walks you through how to use one of those themes. But as we show in the resources here, if you didn't like one of those themes, there is a great marketplace where you can go and buy themes. And that marketplace is called Theme Forest. Let's go over to Theme Forest. You can get there at themeforest.net or if you would like to use our affiliate link so that if you do make a purchase, we get a little bit of commission. You can go to smartpassiveincome.com slash theme forest. We'll go over to the marketplace and I will show you how to find a theme. I'll show you their number one theme. It's called the Avada theme. And it is a very multifaceted theme that will probably be similar to what you're looking for. So here we are on Theme Forest, and I am going to go to WordPress because I'm looking to set up a WordPress website. And if I scroll down, I can see the weekly bestsellers. Avada is listed there. Um, and the Avada theme is just very versatile. You can click on Live Preview, and that will take you to an example website built with the theme. And you can see they've got a lot to offer here. One of the things that I really like are their pre-built websites. So they've got a bunch of different websites that you can just load in one of their pre-built websites and then start customizing it, changing out the, the images, changing out the colors, the content until the website becomes your own. So I'm gonna purchase this theme, I'll put it in checkout and I am a very uh, confident WordPress user so I am not going to add on any additional support. Um, I'm just gonna buy the theme. And then you'll need an account to sign in to uh, ThemeForest. It's actually the parent company is called Envato. And what is nice about setting up an account there is that then in the future, if you ever need to download anything you've purchased in the past, you can go back and download it again. So you know how a shopping cart works, so I'll meet you after I've made my purchase. Here I am on the payment complete page and I can just click the green button to download a zip file. But there's something that you should know for later on when you go to install it. This zip file is going to be the thing you need to install in WordPress plus some other stuff. And so this is not the zip file that you will be uploading into WordPress. That's nested inside of this file, but there's some extra stuff here. You can also go to your downloads page and we can just click on that here. Or um, if we ever need to get back to this later, you can sign into ThemeForest or any of the Envato marketplaces, then click on your pro profile and go to the downloads page later. And here you can see everything that you've purchased from here before. And one of the things that you'll see on this page, you'll see a little carrot next to that download button. And if you click on that, um, you will see a few different options for what you can download. And one of the options is to download just the file that you need to upload into WordPress. So you could also download that independently here. So now I'll go over and sign into my WordPress website and we'll upload this theme. Now, if you've been working through Build Your Own Brand, you will have set up your website using Flywheel for your website hosting. One way to access the back end of your website is to just sign into Flywheel. And once you are signed in here, you can click on the WP Admin button. The other way you can access the back end of your WordPress website typically is to go to your URL and then 
then add in a slash wp-admin and that will take you to a page to sign into your website. So here I am on the back end of my website and this is a brand new fresh website. I have literally done nothing to this website yet. This is the very first thing that I am doing. So I am going to go on to appearance and this is where I can upload this theme that I've purchased. WordPress automatically installs some default themes. You can see it right now. I have the 2021 theme going. I set this up before the new year, so there's probably a 2022 theme by now. But I will click on Add New, and then this takes me to a place in WordPress where I can search for some themes, but I just want to upload the zip file that I have. So I will click on Choose File, but before I do that, if I'm using that first download package that I got on my payment confirmation page, first I need to separate out the file that needs to get uploaded here. So what I will do is go over to that file and it's a zip file. So I will double click on that file to uncompress that file. And you can see when I uncompress that file that there are a bunch of different folders in here and there's a readme document. That readme document will be very helpful. We'll come back to that in a minute. But the actual theme file that I need to upload is gonna be in this Avada theme folder. And that is just called avada.zip. That's the file that I will be uploading. So now I'm back here at choose file, so I will upload that avada.zip file, or if from the downloads page, I had downloaded the WordPress installation file, I would upload that file here. And then I will hit install now, and this is going to take a few minutes, so just be patient. All right, success. So this is what you're going to see when you have successfully uploaded the theme. Now, if you get an error message on this page, what that is telling you is you tried to upload the wrong file. And what you probably did was try to upload that larger zip file that came from ThemeForest. So be sure to open that up and find just the theme file, or you can go back to that downloads page and choose to download the installable WordPress file only, and then go back and upload that file instead. So from here, you can click on Live Preview, and when you do, the website is going to look kind of terrible, and that's okay. This is WordPress's sort of default way of editing, um, sort of the theme, the colors, sort of the way that everything looks. And you can work in here, but what you wanna do instead, I'm gonna close this out. And this is specific for the Avada theme, but this is gonna be similar for a lot of the themes that you work with from um, ThemeForest, is from here, you will want to activate your theme. Now, if your website is already up and running and you have, you know, you're getting traffic to it, you won't want to activate that theme right away. What you should be working in instead is a staging environment. And that is a much bigger conversation than this video allows for. But you would want to stage that and your host um, like Flywheel likely has a staging environment where you can work on making changes for a while before you make them live and public on your website. So, but I'm starting from nothing here. And if you're working from build your own brand, you're starting from zero. So it doesn't hurt me to go ahead and activate this theme. And when I do, you'll see that um, Avada has given us a good sort of step-by-step -step process for getting started with that website. One of the things that you'll have to do is register your theme. This is going to be really common for anything that you purchase from ThemeForest and they'll walk you through the steps. So just follow the steps here to start customizing that theme. But also I, I referenced when we unzipped that file that there was a readme document in there. Let's go back to that document. And what that document does, and most themes that you have will have some kind of readme file, go ahead and open that up. And what you are going to see in there is just a list of shortcuts to get you over to the support for your theme. It's basically just a text file with a bunch of hyperlinks in it. But what those will do is show you where their support their knowledge base is. And the Avada theme in particular has a really robust knowledge base to walk you through the whole process of getting started with the theme, 
of starting to use one of the pre-built websites. They've got video tutorials, they've got just a lot of information. So make sure to avail yourself of all of the support documentation for whatever theme it is that you purchase. And that is one of the things to really pay attention to when you're looking through a marketplace um, with a whole bunch of different themes is, is there support? Is there a support knowledge base that you can fall back on when you get stuck? But before I'm even going to get started customizing the look of my website in Nevada, I am going to go back to build your own brand and I'm going to work through the rest of the lessons on day two. And this is where Pat is going to walk us through how do we make sure that we uh, have an SEO plugin to help make sure that we can get found in search. Uh, what security plugins do we need? How do we get Google Analytics up and running? And then on day three, he, we'll move on to what does the front end of our website look like and what types of pages should we have on that website? Build Your Own Brand is completely free. So go to buildyourownbrand.co, click on enroll now for free, and Pat will walk you through everything you need to get your website up and running.